All right, coming up next, here from Osme Perfumery, I'm gonna tell you three of my favorite new perfumes that have come out really in the last few months. One of them came out the end of last year, but it's still a new fragrance. Find out what they are coming up next. Welcome back everybody to Joel the Nose. As you can see, I've got my Inter Miami t-shirt from the original season, Lionel Messi here. And of course we're one again, we're in the League's Cup and I won't bore you guys with soccer, but it, it's taken South Florida by storm having Messi play for Inter Miami. It's just been amazing being a big fan that I am. All right, let's get right into this. Today's video here from Osme Perfumery in Miami, of course, as you can see, is three new fragrances that I think you need to get your nose on and try out ASAP. And a couple of them, actually all three of them are very popular and are they're even hard to keep in the store here at Osme. I was talking to Maurice Mbavica before and these fragrances, a couple of them have already sold out and they're just getting them restocked. So let's get right into this. In no particular order, first, this is Astral from, you can see, Serge Off. This used to be Kemi, uh, you know, the Kemi brand, which was under Serge Off and it's kind of rebranded as uh, Serge Off K. And the bottle's obviously very similar to the Serge Off bottle. This is, again, uh, it's Astral. I hope I'm pronouncing it right, but Astral, Astral. This is, came in just a couple weeks ago here at Osme and it's already sold out. They just got some more in, so I guess if you want to order it, you can call them up here or come by the store. This, what's, what I love about this one, it's got an accord called the Shamama Accord, and apparently they use some attar, which is that just essentially the oil with no alcohol. It's essentially just very pure Shamama oil. The Shamama oil is from India, and it's just, you look it up, it's just a very kind of spicy, almost floral, combination of notes or materials. This is just really beautiful. Oh, it's so unique. I love that when I first smelled this, I'm like thinking, okay, is it just gonna be essentially another Serge Off fragrance, which I love, the Serge Off house, but I, I didn't know how different this kind of Kimmy, formerly Kimmy brand would be. But this is really unique. It doesn't smell like anything else, uh, and to my nose, that is in the Serge Off line. So I like that this is new, it's different, Again, it's got this uh, the Shamama Accord. It's got rose, pink pepper, a little bit of spiciness with the pink pepper. Uh, it's got a touch of oud, not nearly as oud-centric as, for example, they have a fragrance called Kimmy, uh, which is literally smells like an outhouse. It smells like, you know, if you're at a, a sporting event and you have to go into one of those porta potties and it like stinks, <laughs> if you like that smell, check out Kimmy. But this is, that oud is, it, Believe me, it's very subdued. It's not that kind of stinky oud. Um, it's got cedar, moss, amber, just a real nice, I think, oriental fragrance. Uh, to me, this is a very good, almost spicy, a little bit sweet oriental. If you like that type of uh, scent profile, which I happen to love, check it out. Next, I'm gonna stay with the Serge Off, formerly Kimmy, Kimmy brand, and this is Love the name on this, Layla. Layla, obviously one of the greatest songs of all time from Eric Clapton. This is what I would call an interesting take on a freshie. When you smell it at first, you're like, wow, this is a really good, unique, freshie fragrance. And by the way, this one has also sold out already within just like, I think two days of it being in the store, it sold out. Again, they're reordering everything so you can check and see if, if it is back in stock. But this one has a interesting clove note at the top, which gives it that kind of spicy freshness and then some nutmeg, also spicy, sweet a little bit. Ylang Ylang, which is one of the classic perfume notes. I really love Ylang Ylang and, and, and Serge Off does a, oh, the, you know, the materials they use are such high, high quality. Um, and vanilla, amber, musk, it also has some cedar in this. This is just a really perfect, well-rounded, everyday, great, useful fragrance. If you're looking for that, especially in this hotter, hotter weather, this gives it a little bit of a freshness. It is, for those people who like freshies but want something a little bit more unique 
and something that's composed with a little bit more, I think, creativity than a typical freshie. So check out Layla. Lastly, I'm gonna go with, from Precious Liquid, this is Aqua Oud. Now technically this fragrance came out, I believe at the end of, of 2022, um, but it just came in here to the store, to Osme, so I just got my nose on it for the first time. And, you know, for those of you who don't know, this was uh, the founder of this house is Richard Herpin, who did Oud Wood for Tom Ford. He's a master perfumer, done a ton of perfumes over the years. He has his own niche house. And uh, Aqua Oud is one of about five new fragrances that just came in, or maybe five or six. Again, top seller. So if you want something that's gonna be popular, well-liked, this is it. This is a very marine-like oud. It's hard to describe, but I don't think I've ever smelled something that has that marine aqua aspect mixed with oud. The oud, again, is there more, I think, as a supporter note to the other notes to give them some more richness, some more depth, so it's not just a marine, typical aqua, freshy fragrance. Um, because you know, it, this is not, again, a, a stinky oud. This is something that's very wearable. And I can tell you right now, it's extremely popular. People come in, they love it when they try these different fragrances. Um, I love the bottle. It's just simple, but it's good. It's unique with that, uh, that label on the front that he has, that gold foil. Uh, it's got really uh, interesting black currant note at the top. I love black currant, uh, osmanthus. It's got, also got some passion fruit and rum at the top. So it gives it a little bit of a spicy sweetness kind of kick at the beginning. Well, actually, and I don't, I haven't put this one on my skin today. Oops, sorry, I'm crushing the, let me go over to this hand. Oh yeah, I, I can tell you right now, this is gonna be a huge hit. Very wearable, gonna be again, very versatile for any type of situation. Could put that, wear it on a date, you can wear it out for the day. You can wear it in the hot sun like today, Miami. You could wear that thing anywhere and it is gonna get the job done for you. So there you go. Three excellent new fragrances that I highly recommend. I like them all. I will probably ultimately be owning, if not all three of them. I would, I would see myself, definitely see myself getting Aqua Oud probably first. I just, I don't know. To me, it's, it's just really great. And then I probably would go with then I would probably go with Astral. Those would probably go with my two choices. Then third, I'd probably go with Layla. All right, there you have it. Just a little of my own personal <laughs> notes. I'll be back soon with another video. Thank you guys as always for watching. Peace, love, perfume, and go into Miami and Messy.